Hey everyone, it's Trish from Bird Feed. Welcome back today for some more Operation Christmas Child shoebox inspiration. We have got two weeks left to pack shoeboxes until collection week. Now, I've finished packing all my boxes that I've planned to pack, but as I was going through my stash to decide what I was gonna keep for next year, and what I wanted to donate as filler this year, I realized I had unicorn stuff coming out of my ears. So I decided to pack two more boxes. A good reason for that was because much of it was donated by a specific viewer who prefers to remain anonymous. So I wanted to definitely make sure I got those things packed and into boxes and sent off this year. And since the five to nine unicorn shoebox that I shared months ago was my all time most popular shoebox that I shared this year, I know it's a fun and special shoebox for a five to nine girl. And um, I wanted to share a couple more. So this is going to be unicorn week at bird feed. I'm going to show you one today and then later this week I'll show you another totally different. So let's get started. This is like I said for a five to nine girl and this box is a three rubber bander. <laughs> it's very very full and when she opens the box on the inside of the lid I've used some cute clip art and wrote on the bottom, you are special. And the wrapping is princesses and carriages, castles and unicorns. Let's see if we can get a full unicorn there. And when she looks in her box, does that not look like a whole lot of fun or what? I tried to pack all her goodies, all the fun stuff on top. So right off the bat, she's got a cute, cute, squishy unicorn. Reminds me of a rainbow corn, doesn't it? Very cute. She's got absolutely the cutest Chelsea doll and car that was sent by this viewer that I was speaking of in particular. The car itself is a little convertible car. It has these rainbow colored ribbons coming out the back. It's got a little unicorn hood ornament and a unicorn across uh, whatever this is, the windshield or roll bar or whatever that is. It's the cutest car. And then the doll that came with it, I slipped into an organza bag with a puppy that she came with. Okay, I tried to keep her hair nice, but it's getting a little messed up. There's her little puppy dog. And then Chelsea has a little skirt on with, looks like a unicorn ice cream cone on the front of her, her shirt there. And also with this car and Chelsea doll came stickers so this little girl can decorate her Chelsea car. And then this viewer who contributed Chelsea and her car handmade some Chelsea doll clothes so the little girl can change her doll's clothes. I just think that's the cutest. Let's see if we can get Chelsea in her car. Oh yeah, she fits in her car with her dog. So cute. Then inside the front seat of the car, I had tucked a little Barbie unicorn, which was also donated by the same viewer who donated the Chelsea car and doll and a puzzle eraser that is a unicorn that I stuck a sticker on there that says puzzle eraser, just so she'll know it's an eraser, just in case she wants to use it as one. She's got a cute unicorn compact hairbrush 
that I picked up at the Dollar Tree, and some Lip Smackers lip gloss in a unicorn tube. Isn't that cute? This was uh, contributed by Denise L. She has a jump rope, a little unicorn kind of backpack shaped bag tag uh, contributed by the same viewer who contributed the Chelsea car and doll. And inside I tucked her hair accessories. She's got an assortment of elastics, hair elastics, and I gave her some cute scrunchies that I found at Walmart after Easter on clearance, but I thought they would be perfect for a unicorn box because they're net and sparkly and multicolored and purple and pink and satin. It just had unicorn written all over it. And she's also got an assortment of butterfly clips that I picked up on Shein.com. Some butterfly metal snap barrettes also from Shein. And then a couple of unicorn metal snap barrettes that I grabbed from the Dollar Tree a while back. Oh, and some pink snap barrettes. She's got a big unicorn print hair bow. It didn't fit into that little backpack of hair accessories. It's got the alligator clip on the back and that came from Dollar General on clearance. So last year sometime, I'm sure. And then let me pull out her t-shirt. Very colorful, pretty unicorn t-shirt that I picked up at Children's Place when it was on sale. I got it in the size large, 10, 12, so it could be sure to fit a nine-year-old girl. She has a soft, furry unicorn purse. <laughs> Isn't that cute? This was another of the cute, cute unicorn items sent by the same viewer who sent the Chelsea doll. Just has a little zipper and it's lined with a pink cord handle. That is sure to be a wow item. Very cute. She's got a pair of cozy socks in a pretty stripe. A unicorn popper, also contributed by the same viewer who contributed the furry purse and the Chelsea doll. She's got a second little Barbie unicorn. This one's in purple. So she's got a pink one and a purple one. She has an adorable little change purse, or I think I'd call this a trinket purse, with a zippered top, has a little bag clip on it, filled with glitter and a Pegasus, glittery Pegasus on the front of it. I filled it with goodies. A pink hair comb from Angie a unicorn watch that I got off of Shein. Isn't that cute? With a pink faux leather band. Um, the clip is still in there so it doesn't wear down the battery. And with that, this, this came as a set with this beaded unicorn bracelet. Little crystal beads and unicorn heart and star charm on it. And then she's got the absolute cutest little necklace. It's a little unicorn, colorful enameled unicorn with rhinestones contributed by Joan Cowan. Isn't that sweet? So cute. And then a little pink flower ring contributed by Stacy Berry. She also has a mending kit from Joan Cowan. And that's all that was, now you can see this a little bit better. The glitter purse and uh, Pegasus on the front. And that's everything that was in her cute little bag. She's got a great backpack, one that I have been trying to pack for quite some time because, man, I don't know when I got this. 
year, two years ago at Walmart on clearance for a dollar. And uh, it's purple and pink, which are the colors in this shoe box with unicorns all over it. Very cute, nice quality canvas. Backpack has the water bottle pockets on the sides. So finally got that packed in a shoe box. She's got my standard assortment of school supplies, pencils, pens, a scissor contributed by Tamara Shields, a highlighter contributed by yet another viewer. She's got uh, a big eraser, some cap erasers, and a couple of pencil sharpeners. And I slipped it into a unicorn print pencil pouch. And the pencil pouch I picked up this year at Big Lots when their school supplies were 50% off. She's got a couple of pairs of underwear in two different sizes. And a couple of pairs of socks, one in a fun kind of rainbow stripe, and one pair that says Be Unique on it. She's got a really cute unicorn journal. Even the inside has little unicorn figures. I bought this at Big Lots when they were a dollar quite some time ago, but I've since purchased a couple more for 50 cents back when they had the uh, school supplies 50% off. And then of course I had to include a little novelty unicorn pen so she can write in her journal. Isn't that a cute set? She has a mini color by number unicorn dreams coloring book that comes with five markers and a regular size coloring and activity book, Rainbow Corns with this giant heart-shaped eraser on the front of it. I picked this book up at uh, Dollar General for 30 cents long ago. It has the cutest images. Now see, doesn't that uh, plushy look like a rainbow corn? I thought it did. Very cute images inside and activities for her. And then I slipped inside the front cover four sheets of stickers for her, including some rainbow corn stickers. She's got a box of crayons to color in her coloring book, a little post-it note pad with a unicorn on it, another like a list pad with a unicorn on it. These I picked up for like, I think nine cents at Walmart when they were on clearance. And around Christmas time, I think it was, I found this magical unicorn sticker face book at the Dollar Tree. This is one of those uh, ones where they have the fun but blank images and then all these stickers for you to create a face. There's a sheet in the front and back. So I thought that would be fun for a five to nine year old. She has a few more stickers, some waterproof stickers. These are really beautiful stickers that I got off of Shein.com. Those skateboard type stickers. I think I dropped one. Very pretty. Yeah, I did drop one, but I can't find where it went, so I'll have to find it later. She has a purple spiral notebook for school and a prayer card. Today's prayer is, I will thank the Lord with all my heart. And I included a purple wooden cross from Hobby Lobby, and I just slipped it onto a black satin cord She's got some My Little Pony bandages contributed by a viewer and I slipped them into a uh, one of those long pretzel bags contributed by Joan and just folded it over. She has a toothbrush and a nail clipper and the toothbrush has a cap on it contributed by Denise L. And she's got a yellow whistle from Amazon. 
So that completes this unicorn dream shoebox that I've packed for a five to nine year old girl filled with some of the most fun, unique items I think I've packed all year. And most of them were contributed by some very special, generous viewers. So thank you to all who contributed to the packing of this shoebox. You're making one special little girl very, very happy. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and comment, subscribe if you're not already, and I will catch you in my next video, which will be another five to nine girl unicorn shoebox, completely different from this one, but just as much fun. I'll see you next time.